Hey, everybody, what's going on? I'm TJ. I'm Judy James. And uh, as much as we'd like to stay and watch Yankee in the South, we'll catch it later. Uh, we are going to go on what is only can be called an absolute Central Indiana treat. Gastronomic adventure. Gastronomic adventure. We are going to the world famous west side of Indy, right around the corner from the Indianapolis Motor Speedway, Mug and Bun, and we're taking you guys with us. Let's go. So I just got off the mower, and uh, Judy just got back from work an hour and a half ago, give or take-ish. I don't know what time it is. Not even that long. It doesn't matter. But anyway, uh, you can see it's evening. Beautiful, beautiful May sunset on the way here in central Indiana. And uh, just to give you some idea of all the hard work, we got about three acres and some change of, of grass that needs to be mowed. I've got all but what's behind that big barn back there. But we are uh, we're going to take the truck today. Uh, the Adventure Mobile is ready to go, uh, minus it needs some LP gas. We don't have any LP gas. But I got the oil changed uh, yesterday, did that, made a mess, very excited about that. We shampooed the rugs, carpets, upholstery and all that. Um, probably should have done the truck too, but we didn't. I don't know, what are you going to do? But uh, it's off to Mug and Bun. We're taking, I guess we'd call this Son of Adventure Mobile. We're taking my old truck, all right? That's what we're doing. So here we go. Alrighty, here we are. I'm not sure where those folks are going, but we are at the world famous Mug and Bun. One of the few drive ins still operating inside of Central. Ooh, we're going to get to park up close. Very good. That's where we're going. Tell me this doesn't scream 1955. Dog's very happy. You got none on your ring. Ooh, they'll be sorry later. They will be not happy about that. But nobody coming, so we're gonna pull right up here. There we are, mug and bun. Leave our lights on for service. We want some service, so our lights are on. Look, they have merch now. We've got merch. Got to like merch. All right. So Judy James, what are you thinking you're gonna have here? All right, three, two. I don't know what I'm gonna have. I think I'm kind of. If you like tenderloins, this place is well known for their tenderloins. But I got your basic yum. Fried food. You fry it, I'll try it kind of place. Judy sometimes gets the... I'm looking at the menu right now. It's right in front of me. Um, I'm almost sometimes tempted to do it. The I'm thinking I might do that. What? I don't know. But those burgers are so damn good, though. French fries are off the hook. They're delicious. Your root beer is good. Root beer is really good they're they are known for their root beer here or their diet root beers that they had they were having a diet root beer shortage that be the right word shortage they they had somebody that made it for them and that person passed away and so they didn't have any to make it anymore oh shut the lights off we will turn them back on there we go very good all right so uh we're gonna look at the menu in order and uh we'll be back in just a second and we're back all right I wanted the double cheeseburger. What'd you get? Tenderloin with mushroom pickle only. Tenderloin and a big basket of fries. So uh, no lettuce, no cheese, nah, no decoration. No decorations. We we don't want a salad. If I wanted a salad, I would order a salad. Um, but uh, so all we gotta do now is uh, we're gonna listen to some uh, Indy 500 uh, radio stuff. Month of May here in Indianapolis. So actually, we're in Speedway, Indiana. Um, racetrack is literally a mile through that back window as a crow flies give or take but uh yeah so we're just gonna listen to the radio they're talking about the race cool stuff like that and uh we'll bounce back on here when our food arrives and we will do a full thorough review not quite as good as yankee in the south but we'll get our best shot for you okay keep forgetting to look over here <laughs> three two all right our food is here and uh i'm gonna have judy show you what everybody got so i can hold the camera and uh then we're gonna eat Tell you how it is. Ready? All right. Uh, here's the family order of crinkle cut fries. Mm. There's a mm. double cheeseburger plain with an interesting piece of white bread in between the burgers. How crazy is that? It's really crazy. Was, you can see I took a bite. I haven't unwrapped mine yet, but it's supposed to be We're a box With, oh, with. 
mustard and pickle. Oh my. It's like ordered. And if you look at that though, that's clearly a uh, processed, that's, that's not fresh cut, that's processed. It's, it's not a grill yet. I'm done. I'm done with the right. It's not a grill yet. It's a mug and bun. But, atmosphere. Muscle car right over there. Check the GTO out. Very cool. All right, go ahead and take a bite and let's get your reaction. No, it's pretty hot right now. So <laughs> we're rolling. Three, two, one. I'm go. practicing for my magazine at you. Delicious. Gourmet, of course not, but we're in a really cool nostalgia drive in. Thumbs up. Um, that's delicious. That's hitting the spot, especially after being on the mower for three three hours, give or take. This is really good. And you gotta chase it. A couple of french fries while you still have the burger in your mouth. Oh, man. Mm. You're on there. So I had my first bite. Well, I broke it off because it was too big. I'm probably going to say this for my lunch tomorrow. Here goes. I guess in conclusion, we would say, no doubt, we come here frequently. We'd say thumbs up. Coming out for the race, you're in Indy for any reason whatsoever. You find yourself on the west side, uh, just off of West 10th Street in Lyndhurst. Mug and bun. Everybody should go at least once. Do you think anything else? I think it's going to wrap it up. Cheers. It's a short one, so lift your root beer. Cheers. Bye-bye. Uh,